All right, third furnace for Hunt Schuler uh, is in a nice attic space just off of the theater room. Uh, we'll obviously need a ladder to get up here, um, but it's easy access, plenty of room. It's a little tight over here against the wall. Uh, it's a th two and a half ton CBA. with a, looks like just a single 60 breaker. Uh, right to left, there's your April air filter box. The can's on the other side of it and you can kind of see, it's a pretty short can, that's the wall right there. Um, but shouldn't have to do anything back there. Supply side's got a bunch of vents coming off of it. Can't hardly even see it. It's bracketed to the floor. But with the moving the removing the April air, um, should actually have just enough room, although you certainly have to disconnect this. Some of these. I don't know, you might be able to debracket it and sorry, that's a really horrible shot. Screw back. There, that's better. Slope. Don't know if it exits outside or not. Um, so it's not terrible. It's got good access. Just uh, probably have to finagle this a little bit. You might be able to move it a touch, but it's like right parallel with the... Um, water heater up here so but like I said I think moving removing the April air with the F100 um, should give you an inch or two to work with because the furnace is 49 so uh, I don't know where the sub panel is I haven't found it yet it's a hundred amp sub panel from the panels downstairs I want to try to find it but the house cleaners are here and they obviously won't be able to tell me but uh, I will see if I can get a picture of that. Otherwise, I might have to call Hunt and get back on that one. But yeah, there's the upstairs furnace. Uh, 